hey, good morning to you. Uh, it's a beautiful morning. I'm out here on the water and just want to share kind of a confession with you that I just haven't been as close to God as I should be. I mean, I'm putting out content and I'm going through his word, but I just haven't been very close with him. And I went through that verse in uh, Joshua where Joshua told the people to sanctify themselves. And I talked about that, like sanctify yourself every morning to, to get ready. And I, I wasn't doing that. And that's what I'm doing out here. Uh, before I recorded, I, I didn't really know what I was doing out here. I just knew it was time with God. I didn't know if I was going to even record. Uh, but I just came out here to sit I don't know if you saw the series last year on um, the water where it went through Matthew from 24 to the end verse by verse on the water God said do it you know on the water every day and I did and, and it was really one of the greatest times of my life waking up every day and the very first thing I do is get some coffee go to the boat start it up get out on the water and spend time with God and and that's what I've been doing, um, or that's what I was doing. I've not been doing that lately. So that's what this is. Uh, it's just time I came out here and prayed. Beautiful morning. It's not raining, but like every now and then you'll feel a drop. So I kind of thought to myself, you know, we go through scripture, you know, what we do. And I really don't know. For some reason, you know, I don't. I don't know what I'm doing out here. I just know that I'm sanctifying myself. I don't necessarily have like a mission, like here's a series or here's what we're going to do or I'm just out here sanctifying myself. And I just want to share it with you because I've been telling you to do it. <laughs> and I don't want to be a hypocrite in that thing. Uh, but it's, it's, it's beyond being one. It's not that I don't want to be a hypocrite in that thing. I don't, but I'm doing it because I just, I don't feel close to him lately and I don't, and that's my fault. That's my fault. Um, I'm going to go to Psalm 51. It's a prayer of repentance. Have mercy upon me, O God, according to your loving kindness, according to the multitude of your tender mercies. Blot out my transgressions. Wash me thoroughly from my iniquity and cleanse me from my sin. I mean, I need that bad. I think we all really do if you thought about it we're honest with yourself for I acknowledge my transgressions and my sin is ever before me against you you only have I sinned and done this evil in your sight that you may be found just when you speak and blameless when you judge behold I was brought forth in iniquity and in sin my mother conceived me behold you desire truth in the inward parts and in the hidden part you will make me to know wisdom you know this really strikes my heart because a lot of times when I sin and I I, I don't really like the Lord's sin it's just really going against the law you know it's it's transgressions and I I get mad at myself and I, I feel convicted, but at the same time, I'm like, but this world we live in, like it's ever, ever poking at you to sin. It's always, and I love that he said this here, behold, I was brought forth in inequity and in sin, my mother conceived me. And that's just so true. It's hard being in a world where it, fallen angels are constantly lying in your ear and telling you to do things that you shouldn't be doing. This world is hard. Behold, you desire truth in the inward parts and in the hidden parts you will make me to know wisdom. Persian with hyssop and I shall be clean. Wash me and I shall be whiter than snow. It's all with Jesus Christ. You know, it's sometimes when I feel that way, I just like, just forgive me in the name of Jesus Christ. And you know it's true, and you know it'll happen. Make me to hear you in gladness, that the bones which you have broken may rejoice. Hide your face from my sins, and blot out all my iniquities. 
Create in me a clean heart, O God, and renew a steadfast spirit within me. Do not cast me away from your presence. Do not take your Holy Spirit from me. Oh, God, no. Thank you, Lord, for all of that. Restore it to me, the joy of your salvation, and uphold me with your generous spirit. Then I will teach transgressors your ways, and sinners shall be converted to you. Deliver me from blood guiltness. Oh God, the God of my salvation and my tongue shall sing aloud of your righteousness. O Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall show forth your praise. For you do not desire sacrifice, or else I would give it. Sacrifices of God are a broken spirit, a broken and a contrite heart. These, O God, you will not despise. Do good in your good pleasure to Zion. Build the walls of Jerusalem, and you shall be pleased with sacrifices of righteousness, with burnt offering and whole burnt offerings, that they shall offer bulls on your altar. I just opened my Bible and went to Psalm 51 and I, I just needed that really bad. I personally needed that really bad. I really feel like more than anything, I just needed to be, be reminded that I'm cleansed by the blood of Jesus Christ and what that means and what I need to do and the righteousness that God desires in us. But he always makes a way. So I'm just going to keep praying. I'm going to spend a little more time out here by myself. I just, I guess, just started filming and randomly opened up Psalm 51. <laughs> so, man, I needed that. I pray you needed it, too. Um, I'm just out here. I'm going to get out every morning. I don't know if I'll film every morning. But I'm going to get out and just spend time. It's the first thing I did. I woke up, I grabbed coffee, used the restroom, came out to the dock and got in the boat and just came out. Spend time with him. Start my day. Hope this video helps you. Sanctify yourselves. It's how you be part of the army of the living God, which is what we talked about in Joshua. And I realize I'm not doing that. But I need to do it. And I am doing it moving forward. So I hope this helps. Any thoughts or insight in it, uh, definitely put in the comments below. Sanctify yourself and uh, hopefully see you in the mornings here sometimes.